Moz 537 is a four-axle heavy-duty off-road truck, which was produced primarily for the needs of the Soviet Army. The car was intended for the transportation of armored vehicles, heavy weapons, missile systems and other bulky cargo both on the road and on any off-road. In addition to being used in the Army, this model was also used in the national economy of the USSR for off-road transportation of excavators, bulldozers, crawler cranes, heavy machines, and bulky cargo. The design of this mighty truck has been carried out since 1956, in the Special Design Bureau No. 1 of the Minsk Automobile Plant. The chief designer of the model was Boris Lvovich Shaposhnik. The first Maz 537 trucks were assembled at the end of 1958, and in March 1959, the model was launched into small-scale production. It continued in Minsk until 1964, after which the production of Maz 537 series was transferred to the city of Kurgan. When creating the 537th models, the Shaposhnik Design Bureau was the first in the domestic mechanical engineering industry to develop and introduce into production an original hydromechanical transmission, a two-speed transfer case, and a bogey arrangement of bridges, 2 plus 2, made the wheels of two front axles controllable applied seven differentials, independent suspension of all wheels, pneuma hydraulic brakes, centralized tire inflation, designed an original trough type frame. Especially for heavy trucks of the Maz 537 family were originally created trailers with a carrying capacity of 50 tons. Car frame, riveted welded reinforced, trough shaped, with channel section spars. Four front steerable wheels were suspended on an independent torsion bar suspension. In order to provide increased strength and load capacity, the rear balancer suspension was composed of two powerful lateral swinging arms, rigidly attached to the frame. Brakes on all wheels of the drum type. The service brake system is equipped with a pneuma hydraulic drive. On the front of the frame is a four-seater inline cab with two doors on the sides and a sunroof. On both sides of the engine compartment there are five narrow and high air intake hatches with opening vertical dampers. Directly behind the cab there is an engine transmission compartment in which a 12-cylinder diesel engine is installed, with a capacity of 525 horsepower and a working volume of about 39 liters. It embodied many important innovative solutions that are still used by global manufacturers of cars and other equipment and engine construction. These are four valves per cylinder, and two overhead camshafts, and direct injection of diesel fuel, and torsional vibration dampers of the crankshaft up to balancing the 12th order harmonics, and a dry sump engine lubrication system. The transmission of this truck is hydromechanical, with a torque converter and a planetary 3-speed gearbox. The steering gear of the truck is equipped with hydraulic power steering. The two front axles are steered. To increase cross-country ability, the inner wheel differentials of the two front axles are designed as increased friction mechanisms, and the two rear axles are self-locking. Interaxle differentials are lockable. Over the years of production, more than 10 different modifications of this truck have been produced. The total number of such trucks produced in Minsk and Kurgan is not known for certain, but it is estimated at 8 to 10,000 copies. And although this model was subsequently replaced with a newer one, it is still possible to find individual Maz 537 in service.